Hello everybody, here it is, brand new APRC to Ono V4, no miles, it's been delivered and I haven't even ridden it yet, so you're going to have the first ride with me. I've basically bought this blind, so I'm hoping that I like it, but hey, let's see how we go. It's a taller C type than a phase 1000 as well. Oh, sounds lovely even with a standard exhaust on it. That's my business partner Paul. Say hello Paul. <laughs> It sounds fantastic. I could ideally do with knocking that clutch lever down a little bit. See you later, Paul. Okay, let's go and have a little play. Thank you. It's a very sweet gearbox, don't even know it's there, but again ideally I could do with just knocking that gear lever down a little bit. It's very smooth through the pegs. I've just tried the uh, quick shifter on it as well and that's really unusual, just keeping the throttle open. I think the best thing to do is to uh, get the baby running and then go and take it for a proper run and see what we think but that gear stick is definitely a little bit too uh, little bit too high I like things to be in line with my body just watch the van it's a lovely gearbox though, absolutely slick you can't even feel anything in it I think the spanners will be coming out. If you look down here, that brake could do with being about another half an inch down. The clutch could do with being like that as well. Just going to get past this van and move in. Very easy to ride. I'm surprised. Very easy. My gearbox is tremendous. Then again, I've been riding a phaser for the last couple of years. Okay, I'm just holding it in second gear. Okay, now! Jesus Christ! That makes my phaser look like a moped! <laughs> right, I've only done 15 miles on it so far. The thing is, it's. Uh, I don't think I need an acropovic on it. It sounds amazing on its own. So I'm just going to uh, fasten myself up. I've also realised as well, I've got a mesh jacket on. There's absolutely no wind protection whatsoever. Just remember that preloading lesson that I was talking about on this bike it doesn't work. If you preload the gearbox, it just changes. And again we're changing down, you just simply just knock your clutch down. <laughs> My lines are completely wrong. I'll tell you what, I've got to get used to this bike. When you try 
trying to do the clutch just changing at uh, lower revs it doesn't work quite as smoothly so I probably recommend if you're keeping it below five or six thousand that you uh, use your clutch to change